Imagine an animal skilled enough to build a home from scratch using just mud and straw. No, it's not a beaver or an insect, but a bird, the Rufus Hornero. This bird, known for its architectural prowess, creates a unique dome-shaped nest that is a marvel of nature's engineering. The Rufus Hornero is a medium-sized bird with a coat of reddish-brown feathers that blends with the terracotta color of its mud nest. This allows it to camouflage perfectly against potential predators. It's not just the color of the bird that's interesting, but also its widespread habitat. The Rufus Hornero can be found across the vast landscapes of South America, from lowland forests to urban areas, making its presence known with its distinctive, melodious song. This master builder's abilities are just the start of what makes the Rufus Hornero truly remarkable. Beyond their architectural prowess, the Rufus Hornero has a fascinating biological makeup. Let's dive into the details of their diet, lifespan, mating habits, and reproduction cycle. The Rufus Hornero's diet is quite diverse, primarily consisting of insects, spiders, and other small invertebrates. They are opportunistic feeders, foraging on the ground and using their sharp beaks to dig up hidden prey, which provides them with a rich source of protein. When it comes to their lifespan, these birds have been known to live for up to 10 years in the wild, a testament to their adaptability and survival skills. This is quite remarkable considering the many challenges they face, including predators and habitat loss. Now let's talk about their love life. Rufus Horneros are monogamous birds. Once they pair up, they stay together for life, a rare trait in the animal kingdom. The courtship ritual is quite endearing, with the male often presenting the female with small gifts of food. Once the pair is formed, they get down to the business of building a home and starting a family. Both parents share the responsibility of constructing their unique, oven-shaped nests, working in harmony to create a safe and secure home for their offspring. The reproduction cycle of the Rufus Hornero is just as collaborative. Both parents share the task of incubating the eggs, which usually number between two and four, in a clutch. Once the chicks hatch, both parents continue to share responsibilities, feeding and caring for their young until they are ready to fledge and venture out into the world. The Rufus Hornero's biology is not just about survival, but also about cooperation and commitment. It's a testament to their adaptability and resilience. This bird's biology, from its diverse diet and robust lifespan, to its monogamous relationships and collaborative parenting, reflects a, a deep-rooted instinct for survival and a strong bond within the family. The Rufus Hornero's biology is a testament to its adaptability and resilience in the wild. Every creature plays a role in its ecosystem, and the Rufus Hornero is no exception. In the grand orchestra of nature, the Rufus Hornero plays the part of both a conductor and musician. One of its vital roles lies in its diet. These birds are insectivores, feasting primarily on ants, beetles, and other small invertebrates. By keeping these populations in check, they act as natural pest controllers, maintaining a healthy balance in their environment. But their menu isn't limited to just insects. They're also known to consume small vertebrates, which further contributes to the equilibrium of the ecosystem. But the ecological contributions of the Rufus Hornero don't stop at their diet. Have you ever considered the importance of a simple nest? For the Rufus Hornero, it's not just a place to lay eggs and raise young ones. Once the breeding season is over and the Horneros move on, these abandoned nests become a prime real estate for other species. Many animals, including other bird species, small mammals, and even reptiles, find shelter in these vacated homes. These nests, crafted with meticulous care and precision, provide safety and warmth to these creatures, and in some cases, a perfect place to raise their own offspring. Furthermore, the Rufus Hornero's nesting habits have a direct influence on the local ecosystem. They prefer to construct their nests in trees, and by doing so, they promote the growth and spread of these trees. This in turn benefits the whole ecosystem by providing habitats for other species and aiding in carbon sequestration, a process crucial in mitigating climate change. The Rufus Hornero is more than just a bird. It's an ecological engineer, shaping its environment in ways that benefit not just itself, but countless other species. Its actions ripple throughout the ecosystem, creating a cascade of effects that help to maintain the delicate balance of nature. 
As we can see, the Rufus Hornero plays a vital role in maintaining the balance of their ecosystem. In Argentina, the Rufus Hornero is not just another bird, it is a symbol of national pride. This small, brown bird, with its distinct song and architectural prowess, holds a special place in the hearts of Argentinians, far beyond its contributions to the ecosystem. Designated as Argentina's national bird in the early 20th century, the Rufus Hornero has since become an enduring emblem of the nation. Its image graces postage stamps, and it makes frequent appearances in literature, music, and art, testifying to its deep-rooted cultural significance. But why this particular bird, you might wonder? Well, the Rufus Hornero is celebrated for its industrious nature and its resilience, qualities that Argentinians deeply identify with. The bird's unparalleled skill in building its home, a meticulously crafted clay nest, is seen as a symbol of hard work and perseverance, values held in high esteem in Argentine society. The bird's nest in particular is a potent symbol. It's not just a home, it's a fortress against the elements built with patience and care. It represents family, protection, and the nurturing of future generations. In Argentine folklore, these nests are believed to bring good luck, and disturbing one is considered a bad omen. What's more, the Rufus Hornero's distinctive song, a duet between mates, is a testament to partnership and harmony, further cementing its cultural importance. This melodious call has inspired numerous Argentine songs and poems, and it's not uncommon to hear its tune whistled on the streets of Buenos Aires. The Rufus Hornero, with its unassuming appearance, may not be the most glamorous or exotic of birds, but its tenacity, creativity, and partnership evoke a sense of national identity that resonates with the Argentine people. In Argentina, it's more than just a bird. It's a symbol of the nation's spirit, a testament to its people's resilience and love for their land. It's a muse, a national icon, and a beloved part of everyday life. The Rufus Hornero, in its own unique way, has etched itself into the heart of Argentine culture. From its mud and straw mansions to its role in Argentine culture, the Rufus Hornero is truly a bird of many talents. As we journeyed through this exploration, we've discovered the fascinating world of the Rufus Hornero, Argentina's national bird. Let's revisit some of the major highlights of our journey. We've learned how the Rufus Hornero is a skilled architect, constructing its unique, oven-like nests out of mud and straw. These nests are not only a testament to the bird's building prowess, but also a perfect adaptation for the bird to survive in its habitat. It's this skill, this innate ability, that has earned the Rufus Hornero the title of the architect of the bird world. We've also delved into the biology of this bird. From its charming reddish-brown plumage to its unique song, the Rufus Hornero is a bird that's full of surprises. It's a bird that's perfectly adapted to its environment, a bird that's a master of survival. Our journey also took us into the ecological realm. We learned how the Rufus Hornero plays a crucial role in its ecosystem, not only as a predator of insects, but also as a provider of homes for other species. The nests it leaves behind often become homes for other birds, highlighting the interconnectedness of nature. And last, but certainly not least, we've explored the cultural significance of the, the Rufus Hornero in Argentina. We've seen how this bird, through its song and its industrious nature, has become a symbol of hard work and perseverance. It's not just a bird, it's a national icon, a part of Argentina's cultural fabric. So as we wrap up our journey, let's remember the Rufus Hornero for what it truly is. It's not just a bird, it's an architect, an ecological balancer, a cultural symbol. Next time you see a clay nest perched high in a tree, remember the Rufus Hornero, the bird architect, the ecological balancer, and Argentina's beloved national symbol.